Hey, I'm Jabo. It's time for Pablo. We're going to be picking a BrickLink Lego order for Michigan Bricks. Or is it MI Bricks? MI stands for Michigan. And I want you to see if you can guess what he's trying to piece together as I pick this order. Uh, I will not do the entire process of me picking it, but we'll show you everything as, after we, as we do it. Uh, just not every little detail of the way. And I may talk to you while I'm doing this. So we'll get right to it. He ordered 40 lots. That's a lot of lots and 827 parts. Let's start with the order. Drawer 159. He got all nine of those. Drawer 389. 389. He got all of those. What is he building? Can you tell? I found these two pieces. <laughs> that was mixed in with the 2x4 uh, plates. And that was in with, for some reason, with the 2x8 red plates. I probably would have needed that later. A red umbrella post. So let's get back to the uh, picking the orders. I got everything in bags uh, from the other stuff. We're going to keep going and we're on drawer 790. Uh oh. I don't think this goes to what he's building. This is like a red herring. Oh. I'm going to give you that one. One by sixes. And five of those. I should do that game I thought of. Well, Somebody else probably thought of it too, but um, can you name that set? What is the um, minimum number of pieces you you could use to name that set? Of course, with some Lego sets, you can have the same parts be multiple sets, but if you're like, you pick a set, and then they got to guess the set that you picked. So even if there are other sets that have those same parts, you know, they still got to guess the one that you've set aside. And that would be... A fun game. It's like name that tune except for uh, Lego sets. Did you enjoy watching me count? Or somebody has already guessed what he is working on. Oh look, more red. Hmm, a lot of primary colors. Go ahead and leave your comment, but don't edit it. So if you make a mistake, leave it. Um, that way I can sort. We're going to see who guessed first. Whoever guessed. I bet you somebody should already know what it is by now. Uh, just where we're at now, but somebody guess, and then we'll just, you'll get the honor. You know what? I never do this, but we can pin your comments. So whoever, but no, I need to pin MI Bricks comments. Oh, and he, but he can't enter because he already knows what it is. What can I do for the person that wins? I don't, I don't know. You just have the honor of knowing that you guessed first correctly. <laughs> All right, let's go to the next drawer, 2248. Oh, I'm doing what I said I wouldn't do. You got all of these blue bricks. Now there's one brick, I think it's later, that used to be hard uh, to get when you're building this set. Uh, but now it's they've put it in more sets recently. In fact, had I tried to uh, build mine now, it would have been a lot easier. Or at least a couple of years ago, it would have been a lot easier when those sets that had it in quantity were still available. But, um, yeah, so the, I like sets like that that you, uh-oh, 2421. Wait, that's 22. This is the green. More green. I'm loving it. Now, a lot of sets from my generation, from the 70s and the 80s, uh, outside of the ones that have stickers, they're actually quite easy or easier than modern sets to piece together. So I actually built a lot of my collection back in the day just by piecing uh, sets together. So got these, these, but not all of them. I gotta go count them. More green. That's a lot of green. You know, I put a lot of green in my store recently, but it wasn't for the set that he's building. It was from another set. I got these actually listed as uh, used. <laughs> I probably could have listed these as new. Look at them. Oh my goodness. Uh, that's pretty good. So the parts that I had... Oh, why am I holding the microphone? Oh, high quality editing. So that's where the 2x6, it goes there. And he ordered 19 of those. Including the same one here that Michigan Bricks is piecing together. And... I think this one is one of those that will be always able to piece together, uh, except for, of course, the sticker. It has a sticker. and But 
all the other parts are pretty much common parts. Uh, sometimes they're not in the quantity in current sets, but like I said a couple years ago, the, the oh man, which yeah, this one. There were a couple of sets. I think one of them was a chess set that had some of the parts needed for it. And if that had come out sooner, I could it would have been easier for me to piece mine together. Uh, but I've also pieced other sets together, like a Darth Maul bust. I did chronicle me doing that, <laughs> piecing it together. And it's got all actual correct parts, too. No substitutes. Another set that I pieced together, which is not his set, is the, um, the Lego Dragon set 3724. Is this the right piece? Yeah, 3724. I pieced that one together, and when I was doing it, I ended up... Uh, there were some parts that weren't available by people here in the U.S., so I ended up buying a bunch from people in Europe. And <laughs> I, I bought so many that I ended up being able to piece together two of them. <laughs> oh, yeah, so that was... I bought too many pieces, but it was cheaper than actually... Um, buying the set uh, on ebay or something like that 47.62 he only needs 12 of these another set that i started to try to piece together and then realized it was impossible was the statue of liberty the set i think it's 3450 it's another sculpture unfortunately that is one that you still can't piece together because there are many elements in it that are only in that set and large quantities of those elements. <laughs> uh, I didn't realize it at the time when I first started trying to piece it together, uh, but um, it um, some of the large bricks that are sand green in that set are impossible to find in other sets. Is this the one I'm getting? Shallow. Let me see. Lost track. Oh, I only needed four of those. And I'm very glad that my wife always thoroughly counts, because this was from an order that she did. There were three left, and there were three that needed to go in his order. And then drawer 4906. Still got that. <laughs> 4906. Ooh, some of those. So a lot of standard bricks and plates. So what he's doing here, you can do as well, piecing together a set. Now i got to go over here. I should have got him while I was here. There's that set again. 49.29 and 49.30. More green. So did you guess what he's building? I'm sure you have. Even if you're new at this game, surely you have guessed what he is building. 49. Oh, I needed these too. Yeah, when you're you think you're recording and you weren't. Did I get this one? I can't. Was I recording when I got that? I got these. These were in K5. He got 20 of these. Oh, here's some more yellow. He got a whole bunch of these. 100 and 127. That's an exact number. R24. What's in R24? Nine of those. We get 40. 40 of these one by ones. Yeah, you get 54. Wow. Of these two by four plates. I think he's going to have one of the rare times somebody buys something from this drawer. Why are the Eagles on here? There's Kansas City Chief, Thomas Tank Engine, Henry, Atlanta Falcons, Broken Helmet. I love this Falcons Trollson truck. Nope. He's getting the instructions to set 7914. Ooh. I used to have a bunch of those at one time. Don't have any now. This one is from Yellow B1. It is these. Two by six bricks, and that is everything. So can you guess what he is trying to build? Did you guess it? Did you guess it? 
I'm sure some of you guessed it. Who was the first one to guess right? Well, we will see when we look at the comments and so sort them by order uh, the order that they were left without being edited. And that person will be have the satisfaction of knowing they won. <laughs> what did you win? Nothing. But um, anyway, that is MI Bricks order. Let's go see what it was. It's behind Yoda. It is that. Oh, I get sad every time I see it. The sticker. A hundred dollar sticker coming off. It's so sad. Oh, it makes me sad. That's, that's what the green is for, for the hat. The yellow for the face, the hands, the red, the blue. So when I was building this, the blue, there were a lot of the larger blue bricks from Vintage Set. So this actually probably has older bricks in it than what it should be. That looks like an old brick right there. Um, so I pieced it all together, then got an, uh, an official sticker sheet and put my sticker on there. And then it's just worn out over time. It looks really sad. It breaks my heart. So Stupid was in a lot of videos back in the day. But you can see him when his sticker wasn't like this. But yeah, it's just, just one of those things. You don't know until you build it. And I think it the sticker got damaged from all the times we moved them. It's like the bricks are connected, but you know how when you're building, moving something this heavy, um, it, it could give a little bit. And I'm thinking that's what happened. It stretched it. Uh, give me your theories. What happened to So Stupid's um, sticker? Um, anyway, thank you, MI Bricks, for the order. And build your own. You can... You can piece this together. You don't have to necessarily even be buying it from me because obviously I don't have a lot of the pieces anymore because MI Bricks just got a good chunk of them. But you can piece together Darth Maul uh, for the most part. It's got some rare parts under here that nobody really sees or cares about. Where are they? Right there, those round ones. I got those from set 6776. Yoda might be a little harder because of the dark orange and the sand green, but it can still be done. I pieced together this one, the Statue of Liberty. I pieced that one together. I pieced this one together. So you can piece together certain Lego sets um, by doing what we call brick linking them together. Oh, here's another one I brick linked together. The Lego Show Truck. So yeah, you can do it. And this is the one we were talking about in the last video. Um, Mayo asked about piecing that together. You can piece everything together in that for about 50 bucks, except for the minifigures and the stickers. So yeah, get you a yellow castle. I pieced that one together. That's the Weedabix castle, but everybody's telling me I got the wrong flag. It's got the wrong base to the Lego flag. Yeah, piecing together uh, sets, that can be a fun thing to do. I've done it a lot from buying bulk lots and getting sets that were incomplete and then finishing out the um, pieces I needed. And I, I, I'm not going to do the tutorial in this video. Um, I might do it in another video, but one of the ways that I've done this uh, recently in different things is put the complete inventory for something, whether it be a set or a mock, put that in a wanted list on BrickLink. And then I can search my own store <laughs> for those parts. Take those first, and then whatever's left, I you know subtract them out. It is a, lot, a tedious process because you do have to kind of go through there and manually remove them. But then whatever's left, I can either find and scattered about in the basement, or if I go to BrickLink, I can place an order or find stores that have the the harder to find parts that I need. So I've done that a lot, and I'm going to be doing that soon with a brick model railroader. Uh, some of those things that I need to build is make a wanted list and then find a store that has them, whether even if it's your own. But anyway, thanks to my bricks for the Pablo picking a brick link Lego order. I guess I did the Pablo, you ordered it, you did the hard part. <laughs> but I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you like, want to see more Lego videos, even boring brick link store videos, subscribe. We'll be doing more. See you. Bye.